The monk is at it again. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just the engineer. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out how to get this nice. Everybody who's wondering why this thing isn't on the air yet, we're going to show you. <laughs> yeah, there's a couple things missing. This area up here was totally empty, and what we're trying to do is build uh, build a way to get the power through. This will work actually pretty good. Hey David, I'm putting some little lugs on it. Cause oh yeah, right exactly. now I'm trying to take that's a high current, high voltage relay, but it's awfully small. Isn't it though? And it, it, it looks bigger than what it is, people. It's and about the size of a quarter, if that much. Supposedly, it's rated to, to carry as much current as this big boy up here in that big capacitor <laughs> and, and this coil. But it sure doesn't seem like it in size. Oh, Steve Nash was wanting to know if you could stand here with a hot dog on a stick and will it cook <laughs> it? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. It might be. You might be able to get away with that, putting it inside the, this cavity up here. <laughs> and here, Close of course, the, door. the new antenna. But uh, this this is what the whole deal is. This this new stuff matching it up to the old stuff. Yeah. Right. So, so I see what goes up here, but how are you going to wire in what goes right there on the bottom of it? Well, this comes off. Oh. It comes off pretty easy. What goes to the bottom of it is just the control voltage to switch it between the main transmitter and our former main transmitter that's now, uh, what is that? Uh, Mitch is... Michael. Michael. This is Mitch. Uh, this is Mitch. This is Mitch. Well, and it's Mitch doesn't give us too much degree. Look at this thing. It is. You touch it, people, you'll know it. <laughs> yeah, I'm afraid so. And look at this. It's got three big fans on it to keep this thing cool. Uh, there are more fans than that, actually, David. Oh, really? The panel that I've removed on the bottom has two more fans. And then this thing here, whatever that is, with the curls around it. Well, this is actually a... A safety item. It's a grounding stick, so you can go in and discharge any of the capacitor power you know, without using your body to discharge it. Because sometimes you know, your body might get a nice lethal dose of it. See, now I had it all wrong. That big box you got over here, which was for the generator I guess I yeah. thought that you needed that for this no and you didn't no I, I, that box is I gotta figure out how to take out that shelf and move some of the equipment around and put that box over by the power panel so it can feed it and then we'll slap the generator outside oh okay and yet you was able to put it on this little box there isn't that wild well once upon a time uh, there was a generator panel kind of like that that sat over here. Mm -hmm. But that was before I got this place. When I got up here, all there were were wires hanging. People, if these walls could talk, you could hear some stuff. <laughs> give, me an op give me something bigger to tie to. Yep, and you still got to find a knob for that thing. <laughs> yeah, you see this on some of this stuff, it'd be these big copper straps, and I couldn't figure out how to connect them into the little thing without some kind of a yeah extension. So thank heavens for some. And this, of course, is so. Is that kind of blue? So you've seen the other one lit up already. So what color is the background on that? Oh, it's just. It's just an LCD screen. It's kind of a greenish. Well, I was figuring it looked blue. Yeah, it looks blue from here. but So it's green. Yeah. Well, this is where it all happens. I mean, that thing is a small screen, but we got the option of putting one right here. 
<laughs> or here. Well, no. No? Yeah. Not there, huh? You should see what's behind here. Behind here is the computer. Oh, really? And it... Well, that's too bad, because see, this, this thing is right here by your nook, and you could sit here and lay down in bed and turn that into a TV set. Yeah, I got a regular TV set. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. No, we got some good equipment. Yes, we're getting there. Oh. And all you people walking around with those people meters, there's this thing. You did us no good. Not one iola of. So, somebody's being mean to us out there. See, we got Arbitron. <laughs> <laughs> this thing, this power side unit is, uh, so all you got to do to go into stereo is to flip it from power side to normal stereo and boom, that's it? Well, yes, but that goes into the Con Hazeltine stereo system, which there are some radios out there that could pick it up. It was the, the best AM stereo system. The other little transmitter that uh, Michael yeah. ha has a Motorola stereo board. No, I didn't know that. I don't see anything on it that shows stereo. And actually, David, you can't get too close, but if you look at this, it's got a a light that says mono or stereo or in stereo. Yeah. Yeah. So how do you switch it over to stereo? Uh, it's, actually, thinking... it's actually a switch on one of the boards inside. Oh. I was going to say nobody's going to notice this time of night. So. No. Well, you know, I actually I've never even done it. Which oh. is kind of weird. Oh, well, we should have some fun. So, but... We've got it. It's a stereo transmitter. Now see, now I did not know that. Yeah. The problem oh. is that I've heard that it reduces the coverage, so... There's no way of knowing until you throw the switch and we find out some night. The con stereo system increased the coverage, and that's why we've got it. Mm -hmm. Even though we're really only using it in glorified mono. Yeah. And you'll notice the left channel people is higher than the right channel. In fact, the right one's got almost no movement whatsoever. But the right channel has, has different frequencies on it. So All right. When you combine them, when you combine out in the air at the radio, then you got all of it. All right, WRVA, take this. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're almost to the 10-minute limit, so anything you want to say? No, I'm just looking forward to firing this thing up. Yeah, and we'll be here. And you'll notice, people, of course, he has it off so that his hair doesn't get any curlier than what it is. Yeah, so. The challenge was getting enough current to feed this thing. Because it, it does take a lot of power. I bet it that's does. So when you turn it on, the, the meter that's outside doing this noise is going <laughs> to... <laughs> Yeah, it may sing itself. So. All right, we're out of here. All right.